Hello everybody, welcome back. It's Mr. Poke Games of Poke Fur. We are here for our uh, survival game, VR, Wednesdays, all that fun stuff. Last week we got some Borderlands. Week before that I made a video about Ark. It'll probably still be a week, maybe two, uh, as I got some stuff going on with work at the moment. Before I have that next series sorted, just because I want to find something good. I want to make sure it's done well It's something we can do for a little while. Arc 2 is coming out this year, but that will be on the horizon several, several months away. Uh, at least, <laughs> at least six months away. Um, so I don't need to worry about that. But I want, because I want things to be done well, I was like, alright, well I don't like to do the two videos of the same thing in a row, typically. Doesn't mean that I'll never do it, it just means I try not to. And so I was like, oh I don't really want to do two Borderlands in a row then. What survival game can I play? And I was like, well... Arc is an option, but I don't want to start anything Arc without it being like my next series. Uh, and I was like, so I have Rust. I got this game to spite Austin because it literally he wanted me to get it all the time uh, when he still when it, right before he left for his new job, and then basically I got it just before he left. And so, uh, I, part of me is posting it to spite him, and part of me is posting it because I figured I'd try it. Um, I figured I could play Zombies. Zombies, I think, qualifies as a survival game. Even though it's an FPS, it's a survival game mode, so, uh, maybe I'll post Zombies at some point on Wednesday. But, uh, at least for this week, I was like, let's, let's try some Rust. Um... Holy crap! What the heck? <laughs> uh, I've never played Rust. Not once. I uh, This is going to be like me being an Ark noob all over again. Just like at those numbers, man. Fuck. Sheesh. It's like I want to try modded, but... Role play. Damn. I feel like to learn the game, I should go PvE. I just... I don't know, man. That is a lot of people. Leave a weekly, monthly. I guess the modded ones are where it's mostly.
I'll give it a shot. I, I've, like I said, I've never played Rust. I don't even know what the fuck I'm going to be doing. I know that, like, some people are going to be like, you're a bitch. You're not going into, uh, <laughs> like I said, I've never fucking played Rust. So it's like loading assets, 100 out of 9,000. Fuck! Uh, no. Uh, <laughs> but it's like, you're a bitch. You didn't go PvP. It's like, even an arc. I'm not really a big, like, PvP survival game dude. I'm PvE, and the reason that is is because I was trained up on PvE. I grew up on PvE. I didn't grow up on PvP. Had I started on PvP, I might feel like that's the norm and be like, you're a bitch, why are you not? Like, I might be saying similar stuff, but, like, I grew up on, like, Black Ops Zombies, which is just, like, it's a round-based survival game, like, game mode. That's just what it is, and it's, like, it's PvE. You're not, it's, I mean, you could troll other players, which, I mean, you could do the same thing in PvE. For like all these other games but it's like you you don't really there's not pvp aspects really um and it's like i i played those games i played other survival games like i've played dead island and i've played uh which by the way that's another zombie apocalypse game that i think is was really fun back in the day when i modded the crap out of it it's not really one once again where you'd fight your friends but it was a pve based night i played those games that's just what i did uh and i have played arc pvp servers before and I just didn't have a good experience. Uh, one where it was where an entire tribe, I joined them, helped them, uh, and then they killed me, took all my shit, and left me with nothing. And I was like, okay, well, that happens PvP, but fuck those guys. Um, and no, I'm not name dropping anyone or anything. And then I uh, talked to the admin and I had to start from fresh. And uh, about a week later, I just grew tired of the server and I was like, I'm, I'm gone. Um, and uh, I tried going to a couple different PvP servers, and it just it wasn't for me. I like Pv PvE. I don't like the idea of I put so much work and progress in just to have it destroyed by somebody else. Because I've never been a try hard at any game that I've played. I don't think focusing on the game that you're playing makes you a try hard. I have to focus to some extent when it's like an FPS or I'm trying to listen for like ambient noise. But like I I've never tried to play competitive. Maybe okay, maybe that could be just interpret those tryhards so let's word like this i don't play competitively i play for fun and because i'm not playing to be competitive i just enjoy playing these games in pve modes or uh what i did for like later like last couple years in high school and even for college like when i played arc and i played on a server i hosted said server for me and my friends and we could all play i did that for this last series uh for fuel Door. i literally bought a server that i for pay making you know pay a subscription for monthly to keep it up and people can go on and do whatever they're gonna do and it's just something fun to do with your friends uh so it it's not to say that i won't play pvp like you guys know I, i've played pvp like I've, I've done battle royales i've done first person shooters like i've done a lot of games to where like it's me versus players i'm not against going against players it's just when it comes to survival games there's so much of a grind i just prefer pve typically and if i do host a server i typically make a rule to where like by the way if this rule existed in all pvp servers i would probably be playing it way more <laughs> um but i have a rule of thumb and i'm just like you it's okay to raid somebody and it's okay to kill them and you could take some other stuff but at no point in time is it okay for you to go in and destroy all their progress and leave them with nothing so they have to start all over again unless they choose to like i've had friends who have like maxed out everything and have been like all right just nuke me i'm done and i'm like okay cool and i've like nuked their base and then they're just like okay well i'm starting from scratch like if it's by choice sure but like you should be able to raid somebody i feel like that's perfectly natural but i i feel like there's definitely a line in the sand so to speak uh and that's just not something that exists because it's like there, there's nobody to enforce said character unless there are server rules whichever server you're on and i'm certain there are servers that exist like bro there are pvp servers that have that kind of rule it's like yeah i'm sure there are but far and few most of them are just like have at it <laughs> the top dogs would be the top dogs and the rest of you guys would get the scraps and it's just like you know i'd rather just host my own server and do what i'm gonna do like <laughs> that way i don't have to worry about bullshit of x y and z as I managed to talk through that entire loading time, but regardless, uh, if you guys like this content, dude, it's still like peaceful for a survival game. I'm sure it's gonna be chaos as all hell uh, going in, but or chaotic as all hell. But if if you guys like this gameplay, if you guys want to see more Rust, if you guys want to see other survival games besides Ark, 
hit that like button <laughs> and comment down below what you might like to see. Uh, I do. Ark is coming back. Ark, the, the server is coming back. Not that same server, but like I will be on a server, leave it open to my friends like before, and all that other fun stuff. If you guys would like to see that, then. Or sorry, not like to see the Ark stuff, but if you guys want to see other stuff, at least while I'm getting that next server ready, just let me know. And I, I will put some stuff in between. Because I'm not just going to be putting VR, 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 VR. Like, I, I'll do what I did last week if you guys want multiple VR videos and where, like, I'll put something on Wednesday and Thursday. Uh, but I try not to put too much of an influx of VR just because there's much more setup required, for me at least, uh, for to make those videos. Um, and some weeks I have time to do all that just stuff and... Ping warning, yeah, you know. I'll struggle if I struggle. I'm not expecting to have a wonderful ping. My internet's not fantastic, but I get by. That That is the important thing. So it's like I takes... <laughs> I'll give some perspective. Uh, like two hour long video takes like maybe about an hour and a half ish to render at times. Um, get if I if I you know typically I'm editing audio audio more than anything else, but kind of tinkering with it. And after I'm done doing what I'm doing, the render takes about an hour and a half, so puts out about three and a half hours. And I'm using this as an average. There are times where it's been worse, and there are times where it's been better. Um, and then uploading it, uploading it can take about another hour or two. Uh, so I'll put that up to five and a half hours and then once it's done uploading that takes off the stress from my PC and my hard drive but it still needs to render on YouTube so the render itself from the SD to the HD version that could take like another hour or two uh, or more because I think the Arkham Knight video or Arkham Asylum video for today is like it's gonna take four hours to render the HD version and I'm like great because I mean it varies by game a lot and if it's an older game it could take a lot longer um, and if it's a newer game then it doesn't take as long just because it's a very it's you know it's already a high definition game and YouTube doesn't have to do much but that's why I'm using that as an average so it could take about seven seven and a half hours for me to get out one thing uh, so I hope you guys appreciate the effort that I put into my content when I can uh, and if you do subscribe hit the like button and uh We'll keep moving forward together. <laughs> Long and short of it. I do wish this moved faster. God, I wonder why. It's taken quite a while. It's almost done loading. Roadside Rex, Terrain Mesh. Like I said, I've actually never played Rust, so it might just be taking a stupid long time just because I've never played this game, but... Austin's had nothing but good things to say, and he plays PvP. I know he's going to try and drag me onto PvP whenever he gets his PC or setup or whatever, but... Uh, Oh, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> mm. That'll be interesting. At least for this video, though, I don't know how long I'm going to make this, but I at least want to get through kind of the gist of get a feel for Rust. Uh, I kind of almost wish I'd done PvP, but at the same time, it's probably for the best that I didn't. <laughs> I don't think it would have been a fun time. <sighs> Alright, I'm going to pause the recording at least until it loads me in, and we'll be back in just a minute. Alright, we're back. Tip in for all available commands. Please respect our server. Ow. 
thought this was PVE. Why, sir? That, that's, uh, that was a bit rude, my friend. That was a bit rude. <laughs> I had just come into existence and I just started being shot. Press Q to enter the crafting menu. Oh my goodness. What even is this? That is wild. That's to hit people with. Oh, fun. Uh, yeah, that's definitely gonna get me demonetized. That's lovely. Uh... Right, I'm gonna mess with my settings. Alright, let me put on censored. Give me one second, guys. <laughs> Alright, I hope that fixed it. How do I... Dude, this is weird. I, I, it's not like Ark where it's like intrinsically simple. Like I know if I go up and I hit a tree, I'll get wood. It's just, it doesn't. What is this? What the heck? What is this? Is this a survival game or just like... 
Like, I don't understand. What was the point of that? Like, I wish I understood. I just, I don't. Yeah, there's nothing I can do. Finally got something I could pick up. Oh, I am getting wood. I have wood. Okay. Okay. So I'm I'm not as as dumb as I originally thought. Okay. So uh craft <laughs> <laughs> like, I, d I have no clue what I'm fucking doing. I'm used to different notifications and everything, so this is bothering the hell out of me, but... Uh... What the hell is this used for? I can't use it against other freaking trees and crap? It's like, okay, so what I use this on, like, what does this get used on? Is this just a weapon in general? Like, you have the, th wheel you're wielding Thor's hammer. Used, okay, used to upgrade building materials. Right click for the options. You can also, pick, well, okay. Most basic melee weapon, okay. <sighs> I need stones. How do I collect stones? It's like I'm, I'm learning how to do the default things, but like, it's not like ARG. I can't just hold E and collect stone. It's just like, okay. Sulfur ore. How can I have sulfur but no normal fucking stone? I don't understand. There's buses in this bitch. Okay. Uh let's let's take a beat. What the hell is this? Multiple vending machines. Stuff. Okay. Let's just keep going in this direction. We'll we'll find something. I I I have no clue. <laughs> 
if I could even make this a video because it's like I don't know how to collect fucking stone. I have no clue how to, I have no water. Thank God it worked. Sorry now. <laughs> but are you trying to lead me somewhere? I mean, I'll follow. I have no clue what the hell I'm doing, so I mean, if you're. Am I supposed to follow? No? Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna go on with my life. <laughs> if I starve to death, I starve to death. I don't even know where I'm going, man. Metal ore. Good to have, I guess. How do you get fucking stone? I don't understand. You'd think you could pick up like a rock or some shit like this, but... No, it's in... Yeet. Yeah, my rock is gone forever, but you know. It's not like I know how to use it for shit anyways. Somebody's asking, like, you know how to drink, like, water? Water? And I'm like, no, I don't have fucking water. I don't even know how to collect stone. I don't know how you expect me to be able to deal with water. That's much too advanced for somebody like me. <laughs> like, what the hell am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to go to a beach and pick up shit off the beach? Stones! Finally! For the love of fuck! Just took me forever to find something I could freaking use. Hmm. Ah, crap. Well. Unfortunately, I no longer have my rock. <laughs> Ten stones. You know what? Fine, I'll craft another one. Sure, why not? Oh, I actually get stones from this. Okay, sure. I'm down with that. Can, can you, like... Can we discuss the fact that it didn't even ask me to choose, like, my character's, like, sex? Like, I, I'm playing a female character, but that was not by choice. I didn't choose that. Like... Nothing's wrong with that. I want to point that out, but I didn't definitely did not choose that. 
There's, this is not the same customization I'm used to with Ark, much less the resource gathering. This is just weird. Like, it's not bad. It's just different. Like, if you played the same game for, like, several years, and then suddenly you come across another game that's, that has a totally different system, you're going to be a little put off to some extent. I would bet money. Work. Wow. Somebody said hashtag bait. <laughs> Well, I'm glad I have. Hopefully, that bait didn't have anything to do with me. <laughs> uh, I feel like I got more than enough uh, stone. Got my little hammer. Got my rock to chuck at people. Come on, break it. Damn it, come on! <laughs> this is this is a little difficult. Like not difficult, sorry. It's just annoying. Because you can't like how can I see where I'm aiming? If I throw this at it, it's not gonna work. But it's like if I throw this rock at it. Also, just something I wanna point out, it said it took ten stone to make this rock, okay? This is definitely well, well beyond your average fucking rock. Okay, no, man, that is tiny as shit. Definitely smaller than the first one that I had. Um, but, like, even still, I need a hundred? I need ten of those, and that makes a hatchet? I'm pretty sure the hatchet needs to be fucking massive for that to actually be the case. So, I have high expectations. That's Those are power lines. That's interesting. I, I, I gotta remember, this is, like, a modernized survival game and where is it I'm used to like the prehistoric let's not do that Nothing's over there. Alright, let's do myself a favor. Uh, what do I need now at this point? I have the wood. I should have the stones. Oh, no, 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 no. I need the wood. It tells me what I have. I have so much fucking stone. I didn't think I had any stone. No, I have a lot of stone, actually. Um... I... <sighs> Metal fragments? I need that for a flashlight. I can make a stone pick, I just need more wood. Okay, so really, I've been running away from trees thinking I had more than enough, but really, what is what I need? Got it. Dully noted. Starving, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. If I do die, at least I'll know what to do for the next time I'm alive. Okay. 
I need more wood. Not berries or some shit I can work with. Like, I haven't seen a single animal. Even though I'd assume they'd be animals. Fishing rod, yeah, I, I can fish, but like. Hide. Leather. Same difference. What an arrow. I need cloth. More wood for a wood spear. Let's make a wooden spear. And then we'll make a stone spear immediately afterwards. Machete. Don't have a machete. Hunting bow. I need cloth for that. I don't even know how to get cloth. Bone club. Bone fragments. Bone fragments seem to be kind of important. Same with metal fragments. Crossbow. Metal fragments. Rope. Things, things I don't have. Uh, let's go to my inventory. That'll work just fine. Let's go to the easy rateable base event.
How do you get food? So that's not how you get water, got it. Arc, that's all it takes, so. I gotta just start dying, I'm actually curious. I wonder if this even works. Doesn't seem like it. <laughs> I should have watched like a Rust, like how to. At least I have no clue what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> Are you serious? I only did two fucking damage. Two fucking durability. I am going to die. Is there like any reliable way to deal damage to this thing? I don't know.
should have had some C4 or something to bust into that place. And there's no way I'd have that starting out, but I can be optimistic. I just want to make it to that bus stop, man. I also wish there was like berries or something. I've yet to see a single animal, man. What the hell? Thank God. I might actually survive by the skin of my fucking teeth. Can I not eat it? That food saved my life. Uh, <laughs> more ways than one. Um, so I'm no longer starving to death, but. That was laggy as shit. It's an outdoor camera. That's so fucking creepy. Somebody could just be watching that feed. 
Oh my goodness! Oh, I'm definitely taking the fucking elevator. <laughs> That's fucking sick. Look at that. That's insane. This game is like more of an exploration factor to it, it almost feels like. Nah, I'm not gonna say that compared to Ark. <gasps> oh shit! <laughs> See ya! Whoopsie. <laughs> I feel like I came somewhere I don't belong. Might be wondering why I'm still risking it. And it's because Curiosity killed the cat. Unfortunately, right now I'm the fucking cat. This is the first place I've found that has had food. I am not leaving unless something fucking makes me. What I will do, though, is craft another wooden spear and make another stone spear. That way I have two, one to use and one to throw. Also, I should make a rock. I need more wood. Well, that's bound to happen, I guess. If I die, I die, but... So eerily quiet.
I'm gonna fucking die. This is what's about to happen. <laughs> I threw a fucking spear into him, at least. Tunnel dweller. What am I supposed to do versus a gun, man? I don't have any guns. <laughs> Fuck I am. Uh Ah crap. Well, all I could say is that I tried. Um, That meat? It's the first time I've seen food. Ah! I got killed by wolves, got it. I thought maybe I'd be hunting them, but no, they hunted me. Great! You know, I, I think I'm gonna end this one here. <laughs> ah! If I was making like an actual like huge effort on, on like rest to start a series this would not be where i'd end it but honest to god i don't see the, me making a whole lot more progress i've kind of figured out the dynamics of the game as far as like basic crafting and what i need to do and honestly i'd probably play modded rest if i chose to play it on my own <laughs> just because like i don't think this is bad it's a new experience it's different i just i don't love it and i don't hate it I definitely enjoy Ark more. And I know you're going to be like, well, that's just because you've played more Ark. Yeah, obviously. But it's just like, eh. The fact that I can't reach into a bush and pull out some berries bothers me. The fact that I can't pick up stones off the ground fucking bothers me. I mean, I could... I don't even get stone from that. Like, that's so stupid. So I'm bl I get stone from this thing that glows and has like the... Oh, that's that's neat. Like, this I get stone from. Stone, sulfur, whatever. It's... I, I just... I, I'm not I'm not crazy about it. I don't hate it. If Austin wants to get on here at some point, then sure. But you guys let me know what your thoughts are. If you guys want to see me play some more of this. If you guys don't. Um, suicide! Oh my goodness. That is kind of hilarious. <laughs> That's kind of hilarious. 
Uh, but no, I, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you do, please like it and subscribe if you're new. Try to get the 200 subs and then I'll get a banner and icon commissioned. Uh, now we're going to go to a black screen because I thought I'd go back to the main menu when it closed out. But uh, yeah, have a great day, everybody, and I'll see you all in the next one. Take it easy.